Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Joel from Terry Chiu Academy. Right now, we are going to solve this question together. For this lesson, we will be tackling a combinations question. Okay, so let's get to this question. This question mentioned how many ways are there to put three coins on a 3x3 three three grid as shown below so that they do not lie on the same line. Okay, what does this mean? Okay, what does do not lie on the same line means? Okay, so for example, if I were to place my first coin over here, okay, you should notice that I cannot put any more coins in this particular row and in this particular column. Okay, so that is what they are trying to tell you. Okay, so let's think about this question. Okay, so how many ways are there to put three coins on a 3x3 three three grid? Okay, all we need to do is to consider the coins one coin at a time. Okay, so if you look at the first coin, you will notice that there is no restriction at all. My first coin can be placed anywhere on the grid. So the number of ways to play, place my first coin okay, is actually 3 times 3 okay, because the grid is 3 times 3 so actually I have a total of 9 ways okay, to place my first coin okay? and you can see that I can actually place in any of these box okay? so for example, let's say I placed it in the top left corner okay? This means that I cannot place my second coin or my third coin anywhere along this row and this column. Okay, so I'm going to highlight that in yellow so that we know which areas we are not supposed to go to. Okay, so now we are done looking at the first coin. The next thing we need to look at is to look at the second coin. Okay, and once you look at the grid now, you'll be able to identify that there must only be four places now in which the second coin can be placed at, okay? Because the other, the other points are actually restricted by the first coin, okay? So the second coin, now we actually only have a total of four ways, okay? As seen in the grid, okay? So you'll notice that I can choose to put anywhere in these four corners okay anywhere in these four boxes okay so let's say for example i choose to place my coin over here on the right side okay the top right side of the four boxes okay the same rules apply okay i'm gonna use a different color to highlight now okay i'm gonna use orange okay so when we place our second coin okay we need to restrict where our third coin can be placed now Okay, so you realize that now because of my second coin, okay, I cannot put any coins along the same row of my second coin and the same column as well. Okay, which actually leaves us to only one way in which we can place our third and final coin. Okay, there is only one way. Okay, and it doesn't matter where you place the first coin, okay, you will always be restricted to four ways for your second coin. And likewise, it does not matter where you place your second coin after the first coin, okay, your third coin will always be restricted to only having one way to place it, okay. So, last but not least, let's place our third coin on the board, okay. So, you'll notice when, that when the third coin is placed on the board, okay, it does not have any other coins on the same row as well as the same column. Okay, so we have actually already almost solved the question. Okay, all we got to do now, okay, because there are actually not only one particular spot in which the first coin can go to, okay, it can actually go to any of the nine spots, okay. So therefore, we can straight away find the total ways. Okay, all we got to do is simply just to take all their number of ways 
and we need to multiply them together. Okay, so my total number of ways will be 9 times 4 times 1. Okay, and if you work this out, you will get a total of 36, which is your answer. Okay? We have now completed this lesson. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed today's lesson. Goodbye and see you again in another lesson. If you would like to learn more from these tutorials, please smash that like and subscribe button.